What is up, everyone, and welcome to episode 98 of the Witch Doctor Let's Play of Pirates 101. Getting closer to 100 of the Witch Doctor Let's Play. It's amazing. Hopefully, everyone is enjoying their day. It is part two of Beachhead, doing Spoke B of the Dungeon of Beachhead. Saboteurs located. Commence attack. The mechanical men, they don't give up, do they? The celestial ministers were easier to argue with. Yes. Last episode, got a new companion, Gracie. So I will use her again. Um, but, you know, as I said, you know, I'm not going to be using her a lot. Um, actually, yeah. Let's We got crazy as a new companion. Started questing through Beachhead. It spoke A of the first part of the dungeon of Beachhead. And now on to spoke B of part two. Next episode will be part three, so we're gonna be continuing Beachhead. It's just gonna be split up into different videos of the dungeons of Beachhead. So next next episode will be Spoke C. Spoke C, part three of Beachhead. If you have updates on the channel, click on the like button for more Witch Doctor Let's Play videos. And if you like Wizard and Pirates 101, subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notification bell so that you'll know when I post Wizard and Pirates videos daily. Explode the dynamite in space. How about that? Uh -huh. Didn't do anything? There we go. Flame star on the one that's about to die. Ah. Attack. And... 
<laughs> wow. Well, it's a good thing I healed Campo. Never mind. He's dead. Oh, <laughs> come on! Really? <laughs> Man. You close. Buccaneer die. Seriously. Grimtooth, what? Are we we'll race you for the win? Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Lost Campo, that's okay. Commence defensive assault. Backup companions. I should maybe level my. Mm, I don't know. I just need to save up tons of companion train points for my main companions along with my backup companions. It depends if I'm going to be using them a lot. So my main companions are going to be dying, but I don't know. I would just need to do like tons of side quests to be able to get them at a good level so that they don't end up dying a lot. If that's what I have to do, then I might as well just do some side quests. Let me know. That would be something good to do. Because it's going to get tough here in Marleybone along with Aquila and Valencia. And it's, honestly, it might get tough with Sinbad. Trying to think. I really didn't have any problems with my buccaneer. Maybe. That was a bit of a struggle on my squash buckler. And probably the same thing with my privateer. Maybe my musketeer wasn't too bad. I would have musketeer companions. And then just like backup companions like Swashbuckler or Sub Buccaneer, you know. Grip Tooth is gonna need some health. Watch this. Rapier has another promotion. I, I 
don't know what level that will be. And Bonnie Ann has another promotion. Mormon will have one. Or maybe that's it. I don't remember. <laughs> Who else has one? Milo will. Milo will have another promotion. Old Scratch? I think Old Scratch should. And that should be it. What is it? What is it, Captain? This one should be dead. Oh, come on. Well, you Okay. One or two? There should be one more. Go below. Hmm, I wonder if we'll find more clockworks down there. Let's get this over with. It's pretty obvious there will be. Maybe there isn't. What is this place? Something strange be here, Captain, my Captain. Beware. It looks like a workshop for a madman. Hey, look! It's one of the golden wheels from the Isle of Doom! Oh boy. I think I might know what's coming up. You know what this is? Hi! It's an ancient carving. There's a lot of them in the ancient lizard ruins back on Skull Island. But the clockworks have got it bolted into some kind of machine. Why? Excuse me, what precisely is this? Don't touch that! This is a... well, it's a kind of camera. But instead of making a photograph, it can capture a moving image. 
Something's been recorded recently. The device is also a magic lantern. We can use it to see what they recorded. Magic? Not wizard magic. It involves refracted light, spun through... Oh, never mind. Here, let's get it set up. Okay. Yeah, who are you? Answer, or feel the wrath of El Toro. It can't hear you. It's just a picture that moves. That's Bishop, Kane's mad tinkerer. Listen. Supreme Commander Kane, greetings from Marleybone. General Rook is, as you know, engaged elsewhere. Thus, it falls to me to send this report. The campaign proceeds according to plan. If events follow current trends, I project Marleybone's surrender within a week. The end game is imminent. Step one, a naval assault on the Isle of Fesh. Last bastion of the Marleybonian defense. Step two, General Rook uses our new treaty with Mushu to launch a massive new attack into Marleybone, not from Valencia, but through Hamamitsu. With the Royal Navy's attention focused on the Isle of Fetch, Rook's attack will take them completely by surprise. Step three. Once the Royal Navy is destroyed, the station's cannons bombard Marleybone into submission in a matter of days. Checkmate. On a more personal note, I long for a swift end to this wasteful conflict so that I may return my full attentions to the grand design. I trust you are making progress with the Celestian computations and regret I can report little progress in the matter of the clockwork birds. I can confirm that your suspicions about their maker are correct and I have identified the markings on their gears as Aquilin Linear B. But what the inscriptions say, or why the toy maker should send so many of his birds into Valencia and Marleybone remains a mystery. Working diligently toward total victory, I remain your loyal servant, Bishop. The Armada prevails. What is this? How did you get in here? Lay down your weapons. You are my prisoners. Not a chance, bird beak. You're our prisoner. Oh, dear. Guards, eradicate them. Wow, we can... Honestly, that's probably one of my favorite puppet shows. Puppet shows. A Pirate 101. Bishop. So he's the next, the next Armada leader, so solid Rokumushu, but we'll get to battle him at the end of Marleybone, but there is also Bishop, so Pain, Deacon, Queen, Rook, and Bishop.
Getting close. Now I'll have to take the belt out. I know. Um, I'm on it. Radio. Battle Angel's gonna die. I want to just start attacking that. Works. We go back to Dog City now. No! The job's not done. We've got two more guns to sort out. The clockworks? Bring them on. Are you afraid? Hey, leveled up. Sweet. Alright. That completes Spoke B. Dungeon 2 of Beachhead. Alright, well, 
that's going to do it for part two of Beachhead. So next time will be part three of Beachhead with Spoke C. So thanks for watching. Click on the like button for more Witch Doctor Let's Play videos. And if you like Wizard and Pirates 101, subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notification bell so that you'll know when I post Wizard and Pirates videos daily. With that, have a great rest of your day today. And I'll see you guys next time.